playoff college football has arrived here in Vigo County for the first time since the 1980s as St. Mary of the Woods begins their quest to win back-to-back -back Midwest Sprint Football League championships. The Pomeroys entertain the Hawks of Quincy at West Vigo. Second quarter, St. Mary's trails 7 0 when the defense steps up with a big time interception. Courtesy Carter McGee, right place, right time, makes the diving interception there. Later in the second, Hawks staring at a fourth and four inside the Pomeroys 20. The D steps up again with the stop, forcing the turnover on downs. It was a struggle for St. Mary's to get anything going offensively early in this one, but this was a big time play here. Courtesy Corbin. And Cleveland racking up the yards after catch to flip the field for the Pomeroys just before the half fourth and short for St. Mary of the Woods when Jeremiah Toski finds Darren Hazard for the first down that would ultimately lead to the St. Mary of the Woods first points of the contest courtesy Drake Varnes kick here Pomeroys trail seven to three at the break third quarter now that defense continuing to shine Jake Skinner Gets in the backfield, makes the big time stop, and he is juiced up, folks. Hook it into my veins. Ensuing play for the Hawks. Halfback screen. Pomeroy's read it, and they end up stripping the running back of the ball. McGee coming up with his second turnover of the ball game. From there, it became the Darren Hazard Show. Mr. St. Mary of the Woods busts this one. 51 yards to put the boys of blue in front. 10 to 7. Hazard found the end zone two more times. From there, as St. Mary's punches their ticket to the MSFL Championship game, 23-13. to And it'll be a rematch from last year's Midwest Sprint League Football League Championship as Calumet upset top seed Bellarmine over in Louisville, meaning as the second seed, St. Mary's will once again be the playoff host for the MSFL Championship game at West Vigo next Saturday at 1 p.m.